We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 5 Give you a briefing about the institution. All I know is it's a mental hospital. But they're criminally insane. Gentlemen, welcome to Shutter Island. You're hereby required to surrender your firearms. We are duly appointed federal marshals. But during your stay, you will obey protocol. Is that understood? We take only the most dangerous, damaged patients. Ones no other hospital can manage. These are all violent defenders, right? <laughs> They've hurt people, murdered them in some cases. In almost all cases, yes. We try to provide them with a measure of calm. Personally, Doctor, I'd have to say screw their sense of calm. So this prisoner escapes in the last 24 hours. We don't know how she got out of her room. It's as if she evaporated straight through the walls. We haven't heard the truth once yet, but no one will talk. It's like they're scared of something. It's all down, all the lines, even radio. Whatever the hell's going on here, it's bad. We need to ask you some questions, okay? Do you know what fear does to the mind? It corrodes it, rusts it. This is a game. You're a rat in a maze. Who did this to you? Going somewhere? I've built something valuable here. I'm not going to give up without a fight. What if while you were looking into them, they were looking into you? Now they have us both here now. Let me see your face. Let me see your damn face now! Go move, go move! Wouldn't you agree? When you see a monster, you must stop it. Number four. Dave, do you mind if I ask you a personal question? No, not at all. I've wondered whether you might be having some second thoughts about the mission. How do you mean? Rumors about something being dug up on the moon. I never gave these stories much credence, but particularly in view of some of the other things that have happened, I find them difficult to put out of my mind. Open the pod bay doors, please, Hal. Open the pod bay doors, Hal. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. What are you talking about, Hal? This conversation can serve no purpose anymore. Goodbye. Number three. I guess I've already told you about my condition. Funny, every time I see you. You don't remember where you've been or what you've just done. I can't make new memories. Everything just fades. 
What's the last thing you do remember? My wife. That's sweet. Dying. You really want to get this guy, don't you? My wife deserves vengeance. When you find this guy, what are you going to do? I'm going to kill him. Somebody's got to pay, Lenny. Somebody always pays. You have to be very careful. You wander around playing detective. Maybe you should start investigating yourself. This guy is so dangerous, he's gonna kill me. Who is he? What do you want from me? I want my life back! I think someone's trying to get me to kill the wrong guy. You can question everything. You can never know anything for sure. There are things you know for sure. You can't trust him. Even if you get revenge, you're not gonna remember it. You're not even gonna know that it happened. Who did this to you? You did. You don't know. Who you are. Number two. Shoot me. Come on. No, I can't do shoot. it. <laughs> How'd you like that? <laughs> How do you do it? Magic. I'll perform this feat in a manner never before seen by yourselves or any other audience anywhere in the world. The audience loved it. This trick is top-notch. You need to celebrate. <laughs> a real magician tries to invent something new. Go on. <laughs> it's something that other magicians will scratch their heads over. I suppose you have such a trick. That's you, I do. It's the one they're going to remember me for. What happened? It was the greatest magic trick I've ever seen. I need to know how he does it. He has no trick. It's real. Every great magic trick consists of three acts. The first act is called the pledge. The magician shows you something ordinary. But of course, it probably isn't. The second act is called the turn. He's obsessed with discovering your method. The magician makes this ordinary something do something extraordinary. Huh. Now you're looking for the secret, but you won't find it. That's why there's a third act called The Prestige. This is the part with the twists and turns, where lives hang in the balance. Julie, come on! And you see something shocking you've never seen before. Ah! This was built by a man who can actually do what magicians pretend to do. Real magic. I know what you really are! How does he do it? You want the truth. Nothing is impossible. Never get that, bro. No more secrets. Secrets of my life. Number one. There's one thing you should know about me. I specialize in a very specific type of security. Subconscious security. You're talking about dreams? Mr. Carl has a job offer he would like to discuss with you. What kind of work placement? Not exactly. We create the world of the dream. We bring the subject into that dream, and they fill it with their secrets. Then you break in and steal it. Well, it's not, strictly speaking, legal. It's called Inception. I'm ready. found a way home. And this last job, that's how I get there. Dreams feel real while we're in them. It's only when we wake up that we realize something is actually strange. It's your sole responsibility. You are not prepared for this.
dreams collapsing. I have it under control. I'd hate to see out of control. You mustn't be afraid to dream a little bigger, darling. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. And for more top 5 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.